Hi guys, right, uh, just a quick one, hopefully. Um, I'm having a problem with Streamlabs. Now, the reason I prefer to use Streamlabs rather than go live with YouTube is if your phone, say you're using YouTube on your phone and your phone times out and goes back to the lock screen, the YouTube video will stop recording. Whereas with Streamlabs, it will carry on recording even if it goes back to the lock screen. So that's hence why I want to use Streamlabs. Um, so I apologise because a couple of times it started and it, and and the video started going and a few people started commenting and, and obviously I didn't realise it had gone live because it kept saying to me there's no persistent stream. Or it says, uh, no bra broadcasts of this type found. So I don't know if anyone knows anything about it or if there's a fix for it. Um, there's a few videos out there that I've looked at but a lot of them are in Indian which is fine I haven't had a problem with that but I don't speak any Indian so I don't know what they're talking about um, I just found another video which I've watched and the thing with previously when you use Streamlabs it would take you through the normal setup like it does with YouTube you know you just put in a title put in a description tag some people if you want to do so or, or list it as public as unlisted or as private or whatever and then you start your stream but it seems now Streamlabs either just takes you straight to public and doesn't give you the option to change it to unlisted or private because if I'm out filming and I want to use that as a backup for me then I don't want people all hopping on the, the channel not knowing what's going on and if I'm not talking using the phone because I'm using my main camera then it's going to be hard to use the main camera carry on filming what's going on and use a, a mobile phone as well so that's hence the reason of, of using Streamlabs because I can close it down and it will still run um, but then I don't want, like I say, I don't want people hopping on the channel thinking I'm going to be chatting to people when I'm you know, out filming. Uh, so it's really just a backup. So if anyone knows of a fix for that, um, I know there was an issue with YouTube turning over from classic to the new, you know, customised dashboard that they've done, and um, whether there's an issue with that. So, but if anyone can help, I'd appreciate it. Um, and like I said, yeah, I apologise. There was a few live streams that actually started, and and I wasn't aware it was going, you know, because I was kind of looking at my laptop and the phone was on the counter. So, yeah. So for those people that popped in, I apologise. And uh, yeah, so that's the issue. So Streamlabs, it will just say, you know, you can't persistent stream, or you have to create an event, or it's just I don't know why they've updated. How can you update something and make it fucking worse than it was? You know, it does my head in. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. And I think it is a problem with Streamlabs and not YouTube because YouTube obviously aren't going to bend over to Streamlabs, are they? It's down to Streamlabs to adjust their software or whatever it is um, to, to make sure it fits with YouTube. If you're going to give the people the option to to persistent stream to YouTube, so. Anyway, there that is in the problem. I'll still carry on looking into it, but if anyone can help, I'd appreciate it. Cheers, guys. I hope this finds you all well, and I shall be back out filming soon. Take care.